Hello Guardians! Just thought I would share my recent achievement, which is to advance your Guardian rank, which I am sure a lot of you have done already. But this is just me celebrating small victories. Well done to everyone that has achieved this above and below this level. It's also lucky that I have done other activities, as you can see. Most things have been complete. Let me know what rank level you are. Probably higher than me, because I'm a bit lazy sometimes. I noticed though, after I ranked up and peacocked around the tower like I was the biggest bird, because you've got to when you're gilded in gold and you're floating around, there was a new interaction with the K6 Memorial. If you don't want this spoilt, then this is the time to click away. Spoiler alert! Last warning now. My first dawning, I didn't know anyone in the city. I was just a little kid, but Cade? Cade brought me up to the tower to hang out with the Guardians. It was the first time I felt at home here. So let's talk about what I just shown so the spoilers continue really in this video if you haven't done any of these activities but of course we hear an audio message from the recently deceased Amanda Holiday talking about how welcoming Cade 6 was to her growing up which is all, always nice to hear I still find it weird however that us hunters still don't have a leader and in my opinion no one is worthy as of yet to lead. As much as I like Crow, I don't see him as leader or want him as leader. Who do you think should be the leader of us hunters? If we even need one at all. Let me know. And that moves us on to another spoiler if you haven't completed this week's We Stand Unbroken quest. And I will play you the last portion of it which is another moving tribute to Amanda Holiday. Enjoy. We've all died countless deaths. But we still only feel loss from the outside in. Holiday. She died doing what was necessary to protect the people of the city. She didn't do it out of obligation or circumstance. She knew it had to be done. And she believed in it to the end. She had one life. And she used it to save us. She set an example for us all. I... I don't know what else to say. Amanda... I would give my light, my last life, if it would bring her back. I've begged before. It's a false hope. A lie. At every loss, the Traveler is silent. Each path I take leads me to a grave. Cade. Sophia. Hakim. I fail them all. I love you, Amanda. I'm so proud of you. Forgive me. As you saw there, Zavala blames himself 
but I think it's a blame we can all share if we need to blame each other. There's a popular theory that Amanda Holiday will come back as a guardian. Not sure how I feel on that one. What is everyone else's thoughts on that? Do you think she should come back as a guardian? That's all I have for you. Thanks for watching. Draven out. Yeah, yeah, let's go. I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse. Man, it hurts. I'm on this earth with my words, and I put them all together in circ, cause I wanna have worth.